And you know I usually do some ocean fishing, so being out here in Arkansas has given me a crash course in all fresh water. So far we've gone trout fishing, fly fishing, stick bait fishing. It's rainbow on that little stick bait. About to go bass fishing. Mm -hmm. oh and we've got a lot more fishing to do. A little bit of bow fishing, maybe we get some gar or something. Maybe do a catch and cook gar. It's a big gar. It's a huge gar, Matt. Huge gar. Oh, don't you. Whoa. But anyway, TJ just got his bass boat back from the shop. So we're about to hit up the lake, get some largemouth, smallmouth, maybe some walleye. It's crazy getting used to fishing with like six pound and four pound on the river. Going at 12 pound, it feels so heavy. It's like, dang, this stuff's huge. It's like when you go home and you grab one of your ocean rods, dude, you're gonna be like, what the? Jazz on. Yeah, Pulled them off the shallow too. All right, got a white bass. Woohoo, gonna release this guy. Look straight it's a small mouth, nice small mouth. <laughs> Look at this. Look at this beautiful small mouth. Caught him on that same bait. There he is. Whoa, that was slow, really slow, almost not even reeling. But I was in probably five or six feet of water, so I reeled it off the bank and then reeled really, really slow. So that's what I'm using. It's got this little special weight that you can slide into the swim bait. It just slides in like that. It's got an eye on top. Push your way all the way to the end, just so the hook is out, just like that. Then once you got it touching the tip there, you can just pop that eye out. Just tie a knot to it, and that's it. I'm on. God, well, it's not big, but hey, it's fish. On that, I don't know what that thing is, a little craw imitation. Mass, dude, your first smallmouth. Yeah, it is my first smallmouth. Not the biggest, but you gotta start somewhere. <laughs> yeah. Well, smallmouth. Throw them back. <laughs> Love that green color. Yeah, so we eat this. Oh yeah. A little large mouth. Jan's on. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> It's got this arrow on the motor pointing the direction that we go. It's a little pedal. When you step on it forward, it moves it to the right. You step on it back, it moves it to the left. And you step on this little thing here to start the motor. Come on. Are you on? Yep. Big old bass. Oh, yeah. Never caught a largemouth. Oh, there's another one following it. Yeah, that's all right. We'll let this one. Isn't that this one? Oh, yeah. When he jumps, you want to stick that rod down so he doesn't jump. If you want to land a fish, you want to keep him down. Oh, baby. Jeez. Nice, Matt. Thanks, man. That's oh, he swallowed it, too. Fish. Got it. Oh, that is nice. Dang, that's a nice one. Right there in that corner, the little the trees are. Yeah, I'm sure there'll be a bunch in there, and there'll be a bunch in here. <laughs> that's a nice bass. All right, I'll just get him back in the water. It's pretty much swim baiting for rockfish. Yeah. Kind of just casting it out and slow rolling it back. She just found a little baby turtle. <laughs> well, the guy better be careful. Dang bass will eat him. Oh, man. What is that thing? That's a bass. Uh -huh. Jeez. Sneak it out there. Got him. There you go. Nice. Oh, oh that's a God. beautiful fish. That's a pig. No, she's a beautiful fish. Pre spawn. She's probably full of eggs. Back here in a wind blown pocket. Back of Barnes Bay. Bite's on. I don't know what's happening. There's a front moving in or something, but the bite is on. It's fun. It's getting progressively worse. It's gonna be a rough ride already. Yeah. And I can't, I can't even hardly hold the boat. The controller motor just sitting there. I can't even. Yeah, it's hard to say. 